In his book, The Book, or the taboo against knowing who you are, Alan Watts examines the idea of the double bind. He writes, A person is put into a double bind by a command request that contains a concealed contradiction. Stop being self-conscious. Try to relax. Society as we now have it pulls this trick on every child from earliest infancy. In the first place, the child is taught that he is responsible, that he is a free agent, an independent origin of thoughts and actions. He accepts this make-believe for the very reason that it is not true. He can't help but accepting it, just as he can't help but accepting membership in the community where he was born. He has no way of resisting this type of social indoctrination. It is constantly reinforced through reward and punishment. It is built into the basic structure of the language he is learning. We befuddle our children helplessly because we as adults were once so befuddled and remaining so do not understand the game we are playing. The people that run the world now are the adults and they've been through all this stuff that we've been through before. They've been through those ceremonial day speeches when people say it's all up to you now. You have to change the world. You have to save the world. You have to help our nation. But if you watch them in action, you'll very clearly see that they don't act as if it were all up to them. If you watch them closely in action, you'll very clearly see that they do not act as if it were all up to them. They act as if it were up to somebody else. Now, there's this thing about, okay, helping the nation, you gotta save the nation from economic collapse. So you, what do you do? What do you do? Economic collapse, uh, we spend money. We, we spend money that we, we, that we don't have. Uh, that, that's a good way. Or, or what is... Uh, what, what does Congress do with, with a lot of people are, are worrying about like their freedoms slipping away or their rights not being respectable? Well, right now Congress has this bill, and uh, it's by Senator Rockefeller. He, he wrote it and sponsored by Senator Snow or something, and it, it's, it's about this internet stuff. And uh, our good people, this, this nation needs to be well protected from uh, uh, stuff that could happen on the internet. You know, uh, uh, the government, it, it's it, in the bill, it's required that that critical infrastructure pieces like ISPs and stuff uh, share certain information about what we do on the internet with, with the federal government. I don't know, maybe they just want to make a safer copyright environment for us all or, or I don't know, decrease child pornography, you know, all, all these good things. You know, they, they would not, they would not be, be like spying on us in some kind of police state. And uh, there's also this part about how Obama gets these these executive powers, and he can he can take control of any private enterprise. You know, during a, if he declares a, a cyber emergency, 